Hey everybody, today I'm going to talk about the misuse of muzzles in training. Now I like to think of the muzzle like a seat belt. You put it on to prevent excessive injury if there were to be an accident. Now nobody puts on their seat belt and then drives chaotically and I don't suggest you do the same with a muzzle, putting it on to your dog and then going into situations where you're not sure what might happen or you're not sure if your dog may be able to cope with the situation. The reason being is because if say you were to put your dog in a muzzle and then bring them to a dog park because you're not sure what might happen, if your dog were to bite another dog, even though there won't be excessive damage because of the muzzle, your dog might actually be reinforced for biting because of what it did to the other dog, which made it the other dog go away very quickly. And once a dog has rehearsed biting, it makes it more likely to happen again in the future than if you set up your training so that your dog never had the opportunity to bite another dog. The other terrible thing is, even if the other dog was not injured, they could be severely traumatized by being attacked by a dog in a muzzle. So that is why I caution you that you use the muzzle like a seatbelt rather than putting a muzzle on a dog and then putting them into situations where you just don't know what might happen. Hey Splash. So I'm a big fan of using muzzles and the way that I like to train dogs to wear them is by teaching the dog a chin rest first. So I'll link a video of how to train your dog to wear a muzzle in the description below. But very quickly, if you've trained your dog a chin rest where they rest their chin in your hand like this, and you can use a cue like chin, where the dog rests their chin in your hand like that, you can then hold the muzzle open like that in the palm of your hand and then say the same cue, chin, so that the dog is putting their chin into the muzzle. And then you can feed your dog a treat either through the muzzle or take the muzzle off and then feed the dog the treat after marking them. Chin, good. Splash, do you think every dog should be trained to wear a muzzle? You do? If you liked our video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to channel Kiko Pup. You can also check out the description for an article on the misuse of muzzles. Bye!